Hello everybody, this is Out of the Box Unboxing and in today's episode I'm going to make a first impression review of a paddle mixer. Uh, the practical test will follow later on because I need to prefer, prepare for that. Uh, but I would like to share with you my uh, thoughts about this, uh, this tool. Um, uh, basically, my, my, um, my impression is rather, rather good. And if you want to know, stay till end of the video. So, basic features. Uh, power consumption, uh, 1600 watts. Uh, no load rotation up to 700 RPMs. Mix and paddle treat. Uh, Ford M, it's a F M14. The, mm, the, the, the whole, the, 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 the mixer head, it's a 130. 8 milliliter, milli, uh, millimeters um, long. Uh, what else? It has a one universal mixer, two pieces. This is the one. Uh, two, uh, two assembly uh, spanners included. The, by the way, the dimension is 22. And yeah, they are rather standard, so you don't need to bother to keep them if you have a, pop, a proper uh, toolbox. And cable. Four meters. So, uh, what I have noticed: first of all, it's quite heavy. So I'm, let's say, I know it's not a fair judgment, but uh, if there is a weight, there is a material behind that. So I would say at least this uh, this is uh, matching. Uh, what else uh, on the on the good side, on the on the plus side? Uh, this rubber coverage of uh, button on off. It will protect you uh, for I mean against uh, splashes if you uh, mix uh, some kind of uh, coating some kind of paint for concrete uh, I would say the uh, picture on the box is uh, suggesting it but I would not be so sure about it uh, on minus I would say those buttons because I have saw it in other uh, parkside tools and it's sticker and you can see it's actually already moving so it's just a question of time well when it will um, uh, fall off so you're gonna have a problem and actually I can I can or I cannot yes I can easily see this is the sticker okay it will work without it but um, the question is and uh, other question what, what how it was um, uh, uh, sticked into it I'm just assuming it was like it is like like this and second uh, it's not waterproof uh, solution so they have made quite good switchers here and uh, cut cost uh, let me say two centimeters later on such uh, sorry on such uh, uh, speed adjustment so it's a uh, it's 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 a little bit odd so uh, yeah by the way let's turn it on and let's see at least after how it's working without any load so okay it's a protection here and now I will play it with a speed speed adjustment This is a minimum, actually they are not uh, mentioning uh, what is the minimum speed, but I would say something like 200 uh, RPMs. Yes. And what I can say straight away that it's uh, it's uh, already peeling off falling off this this sticker so it's very very bad design what 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 can we do what we can do it's a keep recipe because it has a three years warranty and if from any reason you don't want to have it anymore 
you can raise a claim only by pointing that this uh, power or RPMs adjustment have the just fall off so please fix it and rather they will just give you a, your money back so um, this is my opinion I'm curious about yours and a proper test will, will follow thank you for watching stay tuned and see you next time bye